This is a story of two men of God. Henry Covington, he took a roundabout route to his calling. The other is Albert Lewis. He took a more traditional path. It all started with a question. What do you do my eulogy? What? It's what they say when no, someone... I know, I know what... It... I was a sports writer. I'd never done anything like what he was asking. You're not even religious. Well, I used to be when I was a kid. I'd go to synagogue every Saturday. Today's Saturday. And I am covering a baseball game. <laughs> My search for a eulogy meant many trips back and forth to see Albert Lewis. Hello, Mitchell. Well, hello. What? Your vest. You like? I'm a Navy store. <laughs> you do that every morning? What about you? What's your morning ritual? This and Sports Center. You could squeeze a little prayer in during commercials. <laughs> we don't have kids. We don't belong anywhere. What you don't do for kids, you could do for others. I was wondering if you or if this place needed some assistance. I ought to tell you something. I'm an ex-con, OK? I did some time for manslaughter. Were you guilty? Not of that, but plenty of other stuff. Armed robbery, assault, sold all kinds of drugs. At what point are you disqualified from the pulpit? <laughs> I appreciate your offer, but maybe you should check us out first. I've never really been to a Sunday church service before. It's probably not that much different from a synagogue. Have you ever been in a synagogue? Oh, yeah. For what? We were robbing it. This guy in Detroit, he runs a homeless shelter out of his church. There's this giant hole in his roof. This guy has done some very bad things. I've seen people change. It can be inspiring. <laughs> It's not about having the answers in life. It's about the search for the answers that makes the journey of faith so worthwhile. If our religion is so special, how can you be supportive of others? Did God make trees? Yeah. But, well, okay, why trees? That's... Why not a tree? Maybe faith is the same. Many trees, the branches all going to him. <laughs>